a mustache, things like that. Was a girl, did she have her hair, you know, long, short, ponytail? We keep an eye out for that kind of stuff. Did they say anything? Did you hear them say, you know, give me this, or I want you to do that? That kind of stuff is going to help us, especially if they've done it before. We can compare it with other things that have happened or other incidents, and we can say, look, this is probably the same person. Um, another thing we would look for is uh, once we found out what you saw or heard, then we compare it with other people, what they saw and heard, and you guys might remember stuff a little bit different, and that's okay. It's just whatever you think you can remember, but once we put those two statements together, the things that are pretty much the same, we know is, is probably a good bet as to what we're looking for. That's right. Another big thing is license plates. Everybody's driving in your cars, and if you see something, we try to get the license plate. That's the most important thing when a car is involved. Everybody knows where the state is, Illinois or Indiana, right? Everybody know? So if you can get that and then tell, just memorize that license plate, it's sometimes not that long. So if you can tell, tell us the license plate, we can find out who that is and the car and everything else. Okay? Mm -hmm. A lot of license plates, if it's an Illinois license plate, a lot of them start with a letter and then a couple of numbers and a couple more numbers. Anything you can get is going to help, even if it's just a letter and the first couple numbers. Anything, no matter how small the detail, is going to be helpful to us. All right, now I'm going to have you guys tell me something. Don't write anything else down. Do you guys remember it? Okay. See if you got some of it right. <laughs> you got the right. Everybody remember the blue, right? Yep. Did everybody remember the marker? How many of you remember the marker? How many of you remember scissors? Raise your hand. How many of you remember rulers? How many of you remember the sparkling rod? Sparkle. How many of you remember the glow dark star? Rubber band. Black pen. Did all the girls remember the peace sign? <laughs> the candle, probably not so much. Anybody see the candle? The coin? Yes. Paintbrush? Officer Atchison worked on the scene yesterday. I worked one on Thursday. 
Once you breathe that stuff in, you are sneezing it out for days. No matter how well you clean, it is always around. So what we would do is we very simply take our brush, dip it once into the powder, and then do the shake. You don't smear, you don't shake it over like that. You just go in a circle, and that'll spray more than enough powder because it's very, very. If you've seen, if you ever uh, dealt with baby powder lately? And we've got younger brother or sister, maybe. Baby powder is very fine. You have to. It's even more. It's smaller than sugar, so it spreads really quickly. See how messy that stuff can get on a changing day. Exactly. So if you use baby powder, you know how messy that stuff can get in the kids everywhere. Fingerprint powder is even smaller, so it spreads very quickly. All we do is we shake the brush. Say that we're doing the back of my glove here. All we do is spin it in a circle a little bit, and what happens is. With a fingerprint, so, see, they already got a little bit on me. With a fingerprint, the oils that are on your skin naturally, or sweat, or whatever, doesn't have to be a lot. You may not even know it's there. But once that touches any kind of smooth surface, those oils are going to be transferred in a pattern that is a fingerprint. You may not be able to see it with your eye, but the powder is going to bring it out to us. And the powder is going to stick to the oils from a fingerprint on any surface. Put it on the table right there. We'd be able to lift that print up. You can't see it with your, bare, with your regular eye, but if we use powder, if we use the alternate light source, that's going to show up nice and big for us. And if it doesn't, we have got ourselves one of these. So all I do is walk along and go like that. Have you ever seen um, the answer? Yes, I have. You know how you say you have a fingerprint and you like, this one has a fingerprint, this one has a fingerprint? And why does that happen? Because you didn't have any gloves. Exactly right. You know what I'm saying? That's why every single time you're doing anything with your special, we're going for fingerprints. Gloves go on even no more. Or a central pocket loop. Do you see that? Can you get home? Just use this, and then you'll finish it off. Okay. All right, you're all set. Stick it in there. Put it right in that box underneath this. And if you go home, you can use this strip and you can finish off the other boxes if you want. So the next thing we are going to do is called Magnificent Magnification. All right. So I need you to flip. Well, you're already on the page. I need you to write down number four. Number three was the fingerprint, so you don't have to worry about that. So I'm going to show some different things and it like blows up objects like really, really big. I'll get your fingers. And I'll check out my finger. It's really gross because you can tell when I touch stuff. Ew, it why is it purple? Dirt. There's dirt. I touch dirt and it's filthy. It's purple. It's gross. So Ew. see? That's up close. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Go back. Do you can see that. All right. See? And it's like here. Ew. 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 Do your hair. Do your hair. I want to your hair. We're going to do the hair. We're going to do that in a little bit. All right. So, I need you to write down. Oh, your hair. Okay. I know. Just hold on. One second. All right. So, I'm going to show you something. Look up at the TV and you tell me what you think it is. Magnify. Baby powder. Cool. Cool. Salt. 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 Are you going to be a police officer it's when, it's when you grow up? It's bigger. I want to be a detective. Detective? Awesome. Yeah, I was salt. born watching Scooby-Doo. <laughs> I seriously was. <laughs> All right, so write down what you think number one is. All right, so write down your notebook. If you think it's sugar, salt, mayonnaise, hair. Are you guys ready to all down? Yes. So guess what it is? Salt. Who thinks it's sugar? Raise your hand. Salt. 